Well, with the Little League District tournaments heating up and taking shape around the area, the 10-year-old bracket in District 32 has provided a lot of excitement over the past few days, and tonight was no exception. In a rematch from the second round of the tournament, Groves National traveled to Bridge City, this time for a spot in the District 32 championship against Port Natchez. To Bridge City we go, where the Port Natchez squad was on hand to scout tomorrow night's competition. Top of the first here, and this is going to be Kane Warner. He delivers a shot to short. Gage King is going to come up with a nice snag. He'll throw a Warner out at first, but the big man isn't worried. He'll get an RBI for his troubles. Groves National 3 to nothing after the first. Top second now in Carter Mulholland. is going to throw that pitch just a bit outside. Dylan Brown is going to turn on the Jets like Jeff Bergeron. Play at the plate. He is safe. Shout out to the ump for the assist. Groves National, they are not done yet. Ryder McLeod is going to deliver that shot to second. Nice backhand by the second baseman, but McLeod turned it up like Benny Rodriguez. He's going to be safe at first. Clayton Prophet will score. Groves up 5 to nothing until Kane Warner comes back up to the plate looking for redemption. He's going to tell Mulholland, I'm not a player. I just crush a lot. McLeod is going to round second. He'll go on to score. And Groves National is going to win this one 14 to 6 in advance to the District 32 championship against Port Natchez tomorrow night.